Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on determining the mean of one group given the combined mean and the mean of the other group. So we have this problem here. In a class of 30 students, the mean mark of the 12 boys was 60 and the mean mark of the whole class was 68. What was the mean mark of the girls? Now in any kind of problem solving with mean like this, the key is always to reflect on totals. Now let's first work out the total mark of the boys. And remember there was a formula for the total of a group, which was just the mean of the group times by the number of values there are. And that's just a rearrangement of the formula for mean. And that's what we're going to use here. So let's work out the total of the boys. Well, we've got a mean of 60 for those boys. And how many boys were there? 12. So when we do 60 times 12, that is going to give you 720. So that was the total mark of the boys. Now what was the total mark of everyone? Well, we're told the mean mark of everyone was 68. So the mean is 68 multiplied by how many students in total there were. There were 30. So if we do 68 times 30, we get 2040. So therefore, what was the total of the girls? Well, the total of everyone was 2,040, but the total of the boys was 720. Then to get the total mark of the girls, we just have to subtract these. So we do 2,040 minus 720, and that gives you 1,320. Now we can work out the mean of the girls, because the mean mark of the girls is just going to be the total mark of the girls, which was 1,320, divided by how many girls there were. Now, if 12 of the 30 students were boys, then 18 must have been girls. So we now just have to do 1,320 divided by 18, and that's going to be 73 point something. I must admit, I've misplaced my calculator.